Dream as if you'll live forever. Live as if you'll die today. Those were the words resonating in my mind when I woke up this morning. Who said it? I don't know. Name's Lenny. And you? Jeff. So how'd you wind up all the way out here? In the middle of nowhere. I'm not sure. 
not sure. This I lost my memory. I have no recollection of what happened here. What is the last thing you remember? My wife. Looks familiar. been here before. Excuse me, are you the priest here? Not a priest. I'm the pastor here. Pastor Tom. Jeff. Have you been here before? Uh, I'm not quite sure. But, um, to be honest, I really don't know much right now. I sort of lost my memory. I came here looking for some answers. I'm, I'm sorry to hear that. Um, look, I'd be glad to help. Um, What's the last thing you remember? My wife. Well, I think she is. Well, that's a good start. You know, why don't, why don't you tell me a bit about her? Yeah, see, that's the thing. I don't remember anything about her aside from what she looks like. I got this photo here. <laughs> yeah, she looks familiar. Ariel. Ariel. That's her name. Are you hurt? I don't know, maybe. I just, I don't know. But 
Maybe you should see a doctor or, you know, or maybe go to the police. No. Look, there's no doctors, all right? No police. This is already complicated as it is, okay? Yeah, yeah. You know, Albert Einstein once said, memory is deceptive because it's colored by today's events. Should a man of your position be quoting scripture rather than Einstein? <laughs> Look, what I'm trying to say is sometimes our memories deceive us because our, our present or current circumstances alter our thinking. You know, what we think we remember may not actually be real. We believe what we want to believe because sometimes facing the truth is just... It's too hard. I know her. She's my, she's something to me. I know it, she has to be. Is there anything at all that you can do to help me find her? Anything. Um, her information might, uh, might be in our, our visitor's log. Um, it's in the office. Thank you. Back there. Sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you or anyone. It's all right. That was a beautiful piece. What's it called? I don't know. Any luck finding her info? We're on location standby. What's this? I told you no cops! Sir? I'm gonna need you to stand up and put your hands behind your head. Sir, get up now. Turn around. Hands behind your head. Step back towards me. But where is it? It's in my left pocket. You should calm down, all right? I'm sorry. Copy that on site. Freeze! I said freeze! What just happened? How'd I do that?
Am I a killer? No. No, no. It can't be. What are you doing here? You're not supposed to be here. You need to leave now. No, 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 no. I'm not going anywhere until somebody tells me what the hell is going on, all right? I woke up on a beach in the middle of nowhere this morning, not remembering a thing. I still don't know who I am. Wait, you don't remember anything? Nothing. But you. Found these lying around when I woke up. Who are we to each other? I, um, we were... Jeff. Cal, you son of a bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Stop it! Stay out of this! We did it. What? You killed him. We killed him. And now we can be together. No. No. Uh -uh. I, I don't want to know who I was anymore. This is this is not worth it. Wait, 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 wait. I'm wait, out wait, of here. Don't you see? I did this for you. For us.
try to remember. Sorry, Cal. <sighs> That's your name. Cal. This piece of shit right here is Jeff. My husband. Your best friend. You and I were having an affair. had something special. You should have shot him when you had the chance, but you had to go and fuck it all up. <sighs> I really did love you. But why'd you have to kill him? Why'd I have to kill him? He's a bastard, that's why. Don't you remember our little operation? No. Of course you don't. You, Jeff, and I, we got our hands on a lot of money. 50 million, to be exact. A fraction of that is here, in my apartment, which I will be taking. The rest is in a private account overseas. Jeff had it transferred there and then wouldn't give us the access codes. You and I decided together that we were going to get those codes, no matter what it took. Apparently, you're not man enough to kill your own friend. You hesitated. That's why the drugs kicked in before you could do it. You drugged me. Your sleeping pills. They were only supposed to slow you down after you sent me the codes. I should be out of the country by now. Get the coats now that he's dead, will you? You know what? It doesn't matter anymore. I'm getting what I wanted. Jeff is out of my life forever, and I'm walking away with five million. I am gonna miss those beautiful eyes of yours, though. So pathetic. This is goodbye. I am sorry. So am I. <gasps> I got something for you guys. And I know it's not much, but I hope you like it. <laughs> Thanks a lot, bro.
hear anything, but we're gonna check it out anyway. Nah, man, I'm telling you, I'm a newborn at home. I hear everything. I wanna be too stressed about it. Nothing ever happens around me. Man, you're good, man. I'm telling you. Now relax. I know this isn't right. What we're doing? I know. What do you want to do? I don't know. I don't know. We have to take him out. What are you talking about? He has the rest of our money stashed somewhere. Don't you want to know where it is? He may be the brains behind this whole operation, but... You're the one doing all the work. I'm good at what I do. Do you love me? Yes. Then get the access codes and kill him. You're telling me to kill your husband. You do this? I'm yours. What happened? Jeff! What happened? What happened? Well, let me tell you what happened. You know our little friend Cal? That son of a bitch tried to kill me! That's what happened! Where are the access codes? No, man. No, I can't. Shut up. No. Tell me where they are! If you kill me, you'll never get the access codes! Did you have anything to do with this? Did you? No! Of course not. You think I'm stupid? I see the way he looks at you. If you have anything to do with this area, I swear to God! Jeff. It's me. Your wife. <sighs> okay. Okay, I'll tell you. It's in the poster. It's in the poster! You drugged me. Your sleeping pills. They were only supposed to slow you down after you sent me the codes.
Let your love and wonders come and rain 